Hello, my lovely Leo. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Leo, welcome to your February reading. And today we'll do a singles reading. Single, what I mean through is you at this time, you are not in any type of relationships, uh, loves. Or if you feel for quite a while you've been in this formula, separated or not, you are in that energy of I'm single, I'm mingling, or I'm looking for somebody in here to, feel to fulfill my heart. But single Leos, let's see here what we have for you for February 2021. Was the energy projecting towards you? And of course, what you need to know for you this month. Sun, Moon, Rising Science and Venus Science. If resonately, if resonates with you, loves, I'm very happy. If doesn't, just leave it behind. And that's the energy here of take and look for your reading what resonates for you. Because some of you, yes, you are Sun Leo, but the readings what mostly resonate with you is with your moon, and your moon might be another sign. Let's see, loves, how this month treats you and where we're we moving. Leos. And we have almost all month in retrograde. Sometimes we have some back energy. High Priestess. Leo. Many times the underneath energy, yes reflects your overall energy for the month for you others of you sometimes the high priestess the underneath deck is what you don't see yet for yourself high priest is very much speaking about following your intuition no matter what have assurance that whatever you have the guidance inside you is the best what you have this time. You might connect here with the Pisces, doesn't need necessary to be, but the energy is follow that deep voice inside you. You know better what is there for you to do. Let's see, Six of Swords, Chariot, and Ten of Pentacles. Somebody here is moving. And it's moving towards a better energy. We have Cancerian energy here. But it's like, it's more like a physical move here. Another 10, 10 of Cups, Page of Pentacles, Five of Wands. For some of you, you are moving because of a job. But it's a very competitive job but it's a very good projection of something big two of pentacles you might doubt it or you might still debating it moon a magician and moon again what energy there is something here emotional state energy here You manifest this move, loves. Leo, you did manifest here. Underneath the High Priestess here is Ten of Swords. Something here you feel like, yes, it's over for good. Whatever was in the past. It's kind of like, I need a change. I need a move. And it's something here is like I'm doubting if it's like it's too good to be true something here to go forward with. It's like for one part of you, you feel like, well, I get this. I'm very optimistic of this. For the other part, you feel like I'm not sure there's too many people, there's too much competition, is is this, is that, you know? So that's kind of like the energy, which side you feed more, that's what you get more. 
because we have three chains here, ten of pentacles, ten of cups, ten of swords, ten of wands is missing, putting a burden down. And that burden might be your insecurities. Let them out. You know what's best for you? Absolutely you do. And also, for some of you, you need to leave a past burden behind. And look for this tangible move. Also, whatever you do, single Leos, it's more like be sure to be stable. Whatever you're going to be stable. Okay, but let's uh, do some clarifications here and then we'll go forward, whatever is there. Six of Swords, clarifying by Four of Cups, Star, and Temperance. You do have the Archangels protecting you to move forward from something here. Because there is healing, whatever it is, whatever you leave behind. Five of Wands, Ace of Swords, Lovers, and Ace of Pentacles. There is a choice, loves. There is a choice. And it's kind of get clear of the choice you have. Ace of Swords, Lovers, and Ace of Pentacles. Be very clear, whatever it is, whatever you choose. Also, for uh, those of you Leos who do sign any contracts this month, read the script a couple times because we are in retrograde and you might have some missing points. Okay? So, later to not have a misunderstanding here. Moon. Because there is hidden points here that might not be, you know, got from the first. Two of Swords. Three of Cups. And Tower. And Empress. And Two of Pentacles here. Death, Knight of Wands, Seven of Swords, and Queen of Pentacles. Underneath we have Six of Wands, which is your Leo card, overcoming the things and moving forward brilliantly. Whatever is here, heal the past, my loves, okay? Heal the past. Because if you think right now of a job, there is movement in that energy. And it's moving into something stable. And is your choice. If we talking here about the relationship, a third party, it's over. Okay? And in and out energy here, it's over. Okay? Somebody here could be for you, Leo, here and there, here and there. It's just like for their own good. But they might be involved with others. So somebody here might say like, no more of a third party. I am moving forward with whatever my life gives to me. There is something here which speaks that it's a new beginning here for you, but also don't do well. It's like learn from the past. Whoever is this person, they are a drama person. And as much as you love them, They may not giving you this Ten of Pentacles or this Ten of Cups. 
because I feel here this person is very tricky, very sneaky. They think they they feel like or they they say, well, I will put effort in here, we'll move forward, but the thing is not. So Leo, see the truth and then choose what is best here. Okay. And also protect your goods, loves, because somebody here might, might get pregnant this month unexpectedly. Okay. Because I'm, I'm feeling here there is something here unexpected. And that might not be the best for all of you. Let's see here, Page of Pentacles, what I bring in here, who you are and what you are here for. Knight of Cups, Six of Wands, and Eight of Cups. Ace of Wands, Hangman, and Eight of Wands. There's a lot of communication, whoever is this person. There's a lot of feelings. But when it's about passion, it's kind of like, hold on. Yeah, somebody here feels like they will lose you. But actually, there's a, there's a thing here. It's, it's quite like, it's like a trap energy here. Somebody here want to trap you or want to, it's like to secure their spot in your life for some reason. And it's kind of, they, they might get to you through, you know, intimacy, passionate energy here. Because the thing is, Whatever they offer to you is because they don't want to lose you. And the thing is, this person is not that kind of person they will set, they will set, you know, down and, hey, I want a family or I want to have a long-term relationship. It's like they do project that energy they are telling that thing, but the real thing is something else. Because they are involved with probably somebody else or others. Because I see around the energy, they are their energy. It's not just only you, Leo. Okay? So, be very careful and yes, you, you want to go forward. But you might not get this month the, the things, especially from this person. So that's the thing here with the high priestess, follow intuition. If you deal with somebody here who is non-committal or doesn't commit or is involved with somebody else, be careful with them. Because I feel here for some of you might have a... A surprise here because having this energies here this is um, a pregnancy unplanned pregnancy okay and it's like something here that is not quite welcomed because somebody here indeed keeps secrets so you don't want to get trapped with somebody or you don't want to get in a trap because somebody is immature and you don't want to get hurt again or something at that extent. You hoping on the opposite for this person to be, you know, at the same page. And Spirit says, see the truth and then choose whatever it is. And as well, if is a connection or is a job, 
I feel here there is something here you you need to see clearly first thing first and never doubt your intuition whatever it's for you okay love and light Leos and of course see you next time I hope you enjoyed this reading and give you some clarity and energy for the next few days or a few weeks and of course, we'll see you next time. Namaste.